Hey guys and welcome back to my channel. Today I am doing a huge clothes haul from I Saw It First. I spent about 350 to 360 pounds on this order so I'm really hoping there'll be a good amount of clothes and that they'll actually look good and fit when they're on. I recently did a massive order from Miss Guided and every single item of clothing just did not look good. I was going to do a haul video for it but nothing looked good so I just thought there's no point in me going Here's this, I don't like it. So I'm hoping this one will be better. First up in the order is this t-shirt that I'm wearing. I absolutely love this. It is so soft and comfortable to wear and actually quite baggy. I've got the size medium, but I have tied it up. I really like the print on this t-shirt. It's a thrasher sort of dupe, but it says baby girl new order. And I just think it looks really cool. So here is the baby girl new order t-shirt. I really like this, it is so comfortable, it's not too tight. I have actually tied it up and tucked it under to make it more like a crop sort of t-shirt without having to tuck it in. So I actually got quite a few t-shirts in this order, about three or four. I'm absolutely loving like oversized printed t-shirts at the moment because you can dress them up or just wear them casually. So next up is another t-shirt. This has just got a print on the front. So I've ordered this in a medium and a large because I wasn't sure what the fit was going to be like. And I was sort of going for a slightly fitted but oversized kind of look. So you can like tie it up at the front, you can dress it up with jeans or dress it down with just wearing shorts or cycling shorts underneath it. So I ordered that in the black and also in the white. So I will try on, I've got the medium and the large, so I will try them both on and then wear the one which I think fits me best. Next up is the Ye St. West t-shirt. I've got this currently on in a large. I'm actually quite digging it because it could be worn as like a t-shirt dress. It's quite a lot, I mean, I am only five foot two, so I am quite short. So I think if you were taller, it, you might not be able to wear it as a t-shirt dress. But I think I might keep it in a large because I'm liking it as an option of wearing it like this. I have got my shorts on underneath, and so normally I would tie it and wear it like this, but I also think that looks nice. I do really like the oversized look and I think I'm definitely going to keep the large in this one just to have different options on how to wear it. So here is the Ye St. West top in the white and this time I've styled it with some cycling shorts. This is the large as well and I really like it actually paired with the cycling shorts. I think it's a really good look, really nice for summer especially. Cycling shorts are so good if you get chub rub like me because they come down low enough that that's not an issue. Next up is another t-shirt. This one's just a white one that says 90s baby on it. I thought it was just really nice. I love the colour of the writing and I am a 90s baby so there we go. I got this one in just a size large and I don't think the medium was in stock so I'm hoping that it will look all right. And same with this one, this one is actually a size medium, but they didn't have a large in stock, but this one fits really nicely. So this is the 90s baby printed top in white. Um, I completely lied when I said I only got a large, I did get a medium and this is the medium. So I think the medium fits a bit better. I have again tied and rolled it up to make it more like a crop fit. So I think I, on me personally, I prefer this sort of style when I'm wearing something more casual. It's a really nice print as well. I love the writing, 90s baby. So the black and white tops that I got with the same writing on the front, I actually then got the same jumper or sweatshirt with Ye St. West on it. I just thought I love a big oversized sweatshirt. I live in them at the moment and I really like the print and I'm quite impressed with this because I thought it'd be printed, but it's actually all embroidered on all of the writing. So I'm hoping this will be like a nice comfy oversized jumper that I can just land about in. Here is the Ye St. West sweatshirt i've just paired it with some cycling shorts and i love the fit of this it's so comfortable and cozy it's a proper like fleecy material inside and it's just the perfect sweatshirt for lounging in i love the print i love the size the style everything about it so this is the size small to medium so they come in small to medium and then medium to large and this is actually a really nice oversized fit being the small to medium so after all of the t-shirts and the jumper that I got, I also got this red camel cardigan. If you saw my first video on my ASOS haul, I've been looking for like a nice cardigan to wear with a pair of jeans, maybe like a bandeau underneath. 
and this one came up it's long sleeve i was looking for more short sleeve for the summer but i really like the style of this i like the color so i'm hoping it will look good it does feel a little bit itchy so i'm intrigued to see what it will be like when i'm wearing it if it will still be itchy so here is the cardigan i don't like it at all i feel like it's quite boxy here and it's not supposed to be it's the arms are really long but okay that's fine i can get over that i am really short so that doesn't bother me but it's really itchy like really itchy and i just, oh, i really don't like it i love the color i love the look of it just i don't like it next is something completely out of my comfort zone something that i have never really ordered i wouldn't really wear like a bold print like this but i've ordered so it's this bandeau top in like a dalmatian print and then it's the matching flares they do look a little bit like pajama bottoms and the fabric doesn't feel that thick so i'm a bit scared they're going to be a little bit see-through and also they're super super long so i think that might be an issue but i actually really like this so i'm really hoping it will look good on it'd be really good for like a festival whenever they come back i'm excited to try them on i love it i actually love it i think it's actually really flattering if there's these are quite thin material it's nice and tight to the skin and oh, it fits so well except for the length they're so long you cannot even see my feet they do feel a little bit like pajamas but i don't even mind that they are because they're nice and lightweight it'd be perfect to wear to a festival but it's too long on me it's such a pretty print as well but i saw it first please start doing a petite section so i can get this in petite i love it so the next thing i bought was a like a shirt dress so it's half denim and it's half pink which sounds really weird but it looked really good on the model so it's like this with the drawstring waist so you can really cinch it in and oh, i just think it's something a little bit different and it's quite summery with the colors it is a very thin material which is good for summer but i don't know how durable it will be so here is the shirt dress i oh, i'm not sure how i feel about this one it is really thin material i do like it obviously it would look so much better once it's been ironed but i don't think it's my style i think it's it's i mean my armpits are here and it's down here and I, i'm not I'm not mad on it. I like it and I think it would really suit some people, but I just don't think it suits my style personally. But I love the idea of it not being a full denim dress. I love the idea of the top of it being denim and the rest of it being a different colour. But it is not for me. So following on from the shirt dress, I've got another dress. I really love the colour of this and I love the rib material. It does come with a belt to tie it around the waist, but it does look rather large more like a t-shirt sort of dress with it's got little frills on the bottom and little frills on the arms and it's just like a t-shirt fit around the neck as well so i love the color of this dress but i do not love the fit i think it is a little bit unflattering especially just like this it just it looks like a 90 <laughs> i'm sorry i'm just not a fan i think maybe it would look better like you can't, you can't even properly that looks better actually that looks much better but again i think i'm not a fan i'm not a fan on the fabric either if i'm honest i think it just it's quite an unflattering fabric i like the idea of it but i don't like it on me next up i've got another summer dress this has got a corset detailing more like a tea dress sort of style with ruffles on the arm and also on the bottom I really like the pattern of this. It's just such like a pretty summer dress to wear out. It's quite a deep v-neck, so I don't know. I feel like it might be too low, but we could always pin it up. This is a size eight, so it might be a little bit tight. The material is not stretchy, so that could be interesting. Right, guys, I haven't even bothered tying it up. It's so tiny. There's no movement whatsoever. This is so tight. This is so tight. It's 
quite see-through. I love the idea of it. I like the corset. I like the, the design, but no, it looks really bad. Can barely turn around. It's a no for me. Next up is yet another dress. I thought in my ASOS haul, I had so many like sport shorts and stuff like that. I thought I might try and try out some more dresses and stuff and see see the difference. This one is so pretty. It is the most gorgeous colour and it's so floaty and just, oh, I'm really hoping it's going to look nice, but I'm a bit concerned about how big the gap is here when you try it on. So this obviously is a Bardot one and then the two little strings here tie up, but I think it's going to be quite a big gap. There is also a belt to go around this one as well. I'm just hoping this fits because it just, it's so pretty. It's such a pretty colour. I love the fit of the skirt, but I don't love the fit of this. I've had to tie it on the tightest setting, so it's like really digging in here, but to try and hide the massive gap that is left from this, from the design of the dress. It's so flowy and pretty. But it's the top. If it was a different top half, but the same bottom half, I really like it. Proper summery dress. Right, last dress now. This one is a lot more casual. It's very stretchy. It's quite like t shirty sort of material, but it's got a really nice detailing for underneath the boobs. It does look a little bit see-through. I mean, I can see the tag through that, so that could be interesting. I'm actually really enjoying this dress. I do like the fit of it. It is quite thin material. You can see my underwear through it and you can literally see my belly through it. It clings. I love the detailing around here. I love how it is quite casual, but it's smart at the same time. Smart cash. I think if this was a different material, I would definitely get it because I love the fit of it. I do think it's a really nice length. I do think it's really pretty, but it's very see-through and it's quite unflattering unless you have abs and i don't i've got flaps but oh, i'm really sad because i really like it i think it's such a gorgeous color and it's such a comfortable fit as well but it's another no from me it's a no from all the dresses which is really sad but i mean i'm not a massive dress person anyway and i think they would look great on so many other people i think it's just the look of them on me i'm not keen on right the last thing i ordered was a tracksuit set in this gorgeous powder blue it's so pretty so you get the trackies with the cuffs at the bottom and you also get a hoodie to go with it these are such pretty colors but it's very very thin material so it would be good for summer in the fact that it's quite a lightweight tracksuit but it's not it's not the softest material so I'm not sure if I'm going to like it because if I wear trackies or hoodies or sweatshirts I want them to be the really you know really soft comfortable material and I got these in a size medium so these are the joggers from the hoodie and jogger set I haven't even put the hoodie on. I can't bring myself to do it. It's so hot here today that I physically I'm sweating out. I can't do it. But I really dislike the fit of these joggers. So I'm going to be returning it anyway. They're like cling to my thighs with them. They're all baggy around here. And they look more like pyjama bottoms. I thought they'd be more oversized. Getting a medium. I thought maybe a small might fit like this. But I thought the medium might be more oversized, more baggy around the legs but they're really tight. They feel like pajamas and I am not a fan. This is how long the hoodie is. It's a nice length, but again, just beautiful color, but not for me. So that is all of the clothes that I got from iStore at first. I did obviously get a couple of items in different sizes, but overall I was really happy with like the t-shirts and the jumpers and that but the dresses just weren't for me they didn't fit me properly I really really wish the Dalmatian print co-ord did fit properly and wasn't too long because I really liked it it's so different to what I normally wear but I think that's why I liked it so much so thank you all for watching my haul please remember to give this a big thumbs up if you enjoyed it and please subscribe to my channel I'll be trying to upload videos as often as I can probably more hauls because I've got nothing better to do with my life during lockdown than buy clothes online.
thanks for watching guys bye